I'm going to show you how to install a corner rotating basket set into a 900mm corner cabinet. You'll need a few tools for this, your cordless drill, some drill bits and some marking equipment. Knee pads are optional but you will be working on the floor. Normally in the 900mm corner base cabinet the shelf will be installed. This will need to be dropped to the bottom of the cabinet in order for the carousel to be fitted. We'll remove the shelf supports and secure the panel to the bottom. First of all, I'll just have to pre-drill a few holes and then screw the shelf down with 28mm screws. So now we'll need to start and set out some measurements. Ideally, your bench top would be in place and for the purpose of this exercise, we will put one on top. But remember, this corner cabinet is going to be installed with the bench top in place. So all your measurements and fixings will have to be done with the bench top in place. For the purpose of the video, we'll measure out the bottom first before we put the top on. Always refer to your instructions. I'm measuring from the front edge of the cabinet for the placement of the pole. So I'm just going to join up those marks that I've made and where the two lines intersect, that's going to be the centre point for the pole. And now we'll do the same on the top. For the purpose of the video, I've had to put a bench top on temporarily. But all the measurements that I've done on the bottom, I've transposed onto the top. We've measured everything from the front edge, top and bottom, so all the measurements will be identical. Therefore, our fixing point's going to be round about here. The next step we need to do is drill a five millimeter hole where those two lines intersect on the base. That will then allow this locating pin to slot in and we can fix that to the base. When you're drilling into a plastic fitting, just drill slowly and bear in mind that the pressure of that could actually crack the fitting. You'll notice that the bracket fixing for the top is slightly different to the one on the bottom, but it will still locate in the centre where those two pencil lines cross. With this bracket, we also need to pre-drill. It is with a smaller drill bit, but everything's outlined in the instructions. So now we'll start to install the basket wear. It is going to be a little bit fiddly, so if you're not sure of anything, always refer back to your instructions. Just to make the whole process easier, it may be better for you to build this unit outside of the cabinet so you know exactly how it's going to fit together and which pieces go where. So we'll do that as well. This is the basket mounting cap. This must go on as well. Then we can put another basket in, followed by the final cap. All these things will be adjusted once it's in place. So now you've had your practice run, let's do it inside the cabinet. We now need to extend the centre pole and locate it into the fixing bracket. And then secure it again. Now it's in place, ready for adjustment. You'll notice there's some locating holes here. That allows you to adjust your baskets at whichever height you desire. The locating pin goes right through and then the little sleeve drops down on top. You will need to rotate that so that it locks in. The basket then sits down on top of that and your fixing clip goes in the top. For the final basket, you can leave it where it is or you could move it up and have a higher fixing but we'll just leave it at the bottom. And that's how we install a corner rotating basket unit.